Association is a uh, nonprofit 501c3 organization in, here in uh, central Pennsylvania. We are totally focused on the improvement and protection of the Little Juniata River and its uh, tributaries and watershed as a cold water resource. We've done our work here in the, uh, in the upper part of the watershed and the smaller water of the Little Juniata River because that's where the mischief is done. This is a meandering stream in this area, which is cutting into the uh, mostly silt banks. And uh, we, I, back in uh, 2010, we identified eight sites where there was extraordinary uh, erosion taking place on the stream banks. And we, uh, we identified and then ranked those sites, those erosion sites, and uh, put, put a plan together to, to uh, to repair them and make uh, stop the sedimentation from the erosion over time. Okay, we're standing here on the banks of the Little Juniata River, uh, not far from the settlement of Pinecroft. Uh, we're here because this is a, a site of uh, a lot of our uh, uh, efforts to improve and reduce sedimentation in the river. From here, it's only two miles up to where the outflow from the uh, Altoona Water Authority waste treatment plant comes into the river. So about in the middle of summer, about 80% of the water we're looking at here is coming from that uh, waste stream, or treated wastewater. We're approximately three miles uh, downstream from the city of Altoona. Now, we're an unusual river in that our headwaters are in a, a city of 50,000 people. That gives us an unusual problem of of uh, stormwater management from city streets and roofs and parking lots. And uh, then as the river flows from here, it flows due north to Tyrone, and uh, then it makes a hard uh, easterly turn through a cut in the mountain, picks up a lot of spring water and becomes a, a, a first-class trout stream. In uh, 2014, we, uh, we needed to know more about how these trout move, where they go when the water's too warm, where they go when the water where they go to spawn. And uh, we approached uh, area colleges. Uh, we talked with Juniata College, Denny Johnson at Juniata College. They were uh, very willing to, to help us design a study to put uh, transmitters in, uh, in these fish. We ended up putting 24 transmitters in the mature wild brown trout and then followed them around for about 14 months. We've set goals for this river and for the watershed. Uh, one of the most important goals we set early on was to uh, improve the, the Department of Environmental Protection's uh, listing as far as uh, designated use. Uh, in 2005, the river was determined, this part of the river and the upper river was determined to be impaired for several reasons. Our goal is to get the entire river into high quality cold water designated use status so that we have as much protection from pollution as possible. In addition to, uh, to sedimentation reduction projects, we, uh, we also saw a major threat by uh, private organizations to privatize the river as a fishing club. Ironically, as we improve the water and improve the regulations on the water, it was attracting more and more attention from uh, private fishing clubs down in the lower end of the river. And those clubs were seeking to do uh, leases and purchase of uh, private property through which the public had always had access. Uh, we, we went to the Fish and Boat Commission, Pennsylvania Fish and Boat Commission, and uh, proposed to them that they do a public fishing easement program in this area, similar to what they had done in the uh, steelhead streams up around Erie, Pennsylvania. We then approached uh, all the significant stream bank landowners in the in the uh, 14 miles of catch and release and special regulation water and we sought to do uh, agreements with them based on the same um, structure that Fish and Boat used with landowners in Erie and uh, we were successful in uh, uh, effectively they signed up for the idea that they can never post the property uh, against fishing or boating. Uh, we now have over five miles of uh, public fishing easements in place. Uh, we'd like to do the whole 30 miles. Mm -hmm.